Yeah. Why is there rust on the moon? If space is a vacuum, there should be no water flowing through space out into a vacuum. No way. That should not be possible. It's no way. There should be water in space. Isn't space supposed to be a vacuum? So how is there water flowing within this vacuum? It's no way the earth, can, I mean the moon can be out and they proclaim space. The moon is right here in our local atmosphere being hit by air and water. That is the only way rust can form. Only way. There is no other way rust can form here. No way. And why? What is the black spots on the sun? The majority of the people don't know. They don't. The black spots on the sun are steam spots. So if that's steam, how is the sun made of plasma? It's not. The sun is actually water. They know this. The black spots is steam emitting from the sun. They didn't, they didn't create the earth. They didn't create nothing here. They can't tell us anything about anything here. Give us the man name that went up to the sun and took a scoop of the sun and came back and tested it and they said it was plasma. Give us his name or all that is just a claim. Period. If y'all can't drop a name of the man that went up to the sun and took a scoop of it, came back and tested it, everything y'all running behind the sun is just claims, no proof. Present gravity in a physical form, Gloobers, or your gravity does not exist. What are the black spots on the sun? Hmm? Do y'all know? Do you know? I just want to know if you know. What's the black spots on the sun? Don't worry. We're going to pull some stuff up. Let's see. Let's see. Sheesh. Hmm. What does it say? Hmm. 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 Okay. What is this right one? Breaking, my oh, gosh. See, if I could have been able to see through these here words, y'all. Hang on, let me see. I think it's a two. And I don't think this is the one. Hold on. Oh, this is the one. You see this? The sunspots causes a sort of stellar greenhouse effect that affects the sun's output. Hot water molecules are almost the, <laughs> the most important absorbers. So there's hot water molecules on the sun? <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> the globe is done. That, this from NASA.gov. What you talking about? This from NASA.gov, man. Hot water molecules are also the most important observers of infrared. <laughs> oh, shoot. Oh, it's over, Gloobers. Y'all done. You're done. <laughs> You're done. <laughs> oh, my gosh, bruh. It's over, bruh. Yeah, this is the truth about convection. The true truth about what is. Why do y'all keep I'm over here kicking knowledge. What you know about the earth? About what? What you know about the earth? I'm kicking knowledge. Does gravity exist to you? Oh, uh, yeah. Can you prove it exists in a physical form or it don't? You can prove it exists. Prove it exists in a physical in a physical form. Can you pick up something that literally emits gravity from it? You know what we got on flat earth? Magnets. We have what? Magnets? We have magnets here on flat earth. What do you have for your globe? 
nothing. Okay. Okay. Oh, can you explain? Cool. Okay. All right. All right. Sure. Yeah. I'm a flat earther. I believe the earth is flat. I don't believe the earth is a globe. No one ever in life has literally presented physical evidence behind gravity. Without doing that, how can gravity be in existence? How does it exist? Oh, oh, okay. Okay. I'm there. Right. Okay. No, I had to I had to catch up. So it's like if it's a globe and there is gravity, then things would float as well, right? No. You have you have a great night. Boy. Anyway though, uh yeah. No, she couldn't get it, y'all. She couldn't get it. Honey. We ain't got time. We ain't got time. Not at all. They cannot prove gravity exists in any sort of way at all, y'all. Promise you this. You dig? I'm not here to prove. I'm not here to prove nothing at all. I got a question for you, cause I'm not answering your questions. It seemed like the it seemed like the moon have more dark spots. And it used to see it's only a hundred dollars starting and then it's three fifty to access for your question. Still want to ask a question. Now you was talking about the moon. I saw something about the moon. So I'm I'm asking, like, do you think it have more dark spots than it did when we was younger? You hear me? Get off my live, bro. Good lord. Just keep coming up talking. Stop talking. You wanna ask me questions? Pro gravity exists, so don't ask me no questions and go teach yourself. Walk one, walk hey. one, walk one. How you doing, RB General? I'm good. How are you? I'm great. Uh, so you're talking about religion? You said religion? Yeah. What's in the background? I'm trying to talk. Uh, you want to talk about religion, sir? Are you Muslim? Alhamdulillah. Yeah, you are. Okay. Alhamdulillah. Yeah, whatever. Uh, do you know you uh, actually... Uh, what, what do you mean by whatever? Else? What do you mean by whatever? Whatever. Whatever. Uh, do you know... You were actually divorced Israel. So, no, I'm not. I'm not from Beni Israel, brother. Yeah, I'm just letting you know. So no, I'm not from Beni Israel. Alhamdulillah, I'm not. When it comes to that religion, Alhamdulillah, though, I know my history. Alhamdulillah, I know my history. Alhamdulillah, I know my history. Literally, great, sir. Can you present gravity in a physical form? Evidence in physical form. Can you present gravity in a physical form? Gravity. And can you present it in a physical form? Of course, of course. Oh, great. So tell me what what, what evidence do you want? Tell me. And I Just present it in a physical you. form. Yeah, I here can. on flat earth. Here on flat earth, sir, we have magnets. What do you have? You have on flat earth. You have magnets. Yeah. What, what do kind you have? of magnets are you talking about? Any don't matter. What Any do you have. The, 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 the I'm going to let you know, like, sir. You're just trying to be argumentative because you have no answers. I have answers, but you didn't you're present not, them. I can present them, but you didn't ask a, a specific, ask a specific question. Please and present I, your I evidence bring them to you. Ask present specific her. questions and I bring them to you. I already did, sir. I'm going to have to let you down. You're being argumentative. I don't know what you're saying, sir. You need oh, to no, I answer. said that. Clearly. We have no time for the nonsense. No nonsense. Speak clear, my brother. Speak clear. Don't know what you were saying. Take your spells and keep all that. I denounce whatever you were saying. I denounce it, I denounce it, and I command my energy back. Yo, you remember me? No, I don't. Can you prove How's gravity the ocean exists in a physical of... form? That's what I was asking you. Can you prove gravity exists in a physical form? Yeah. Because if it didn't, then I could just float. How old are you? I'm, I'm, tw I'm 100. You're young. Yes, yes. The gravity don't exist, y'all. As y'all can see, no one can present it in a physical form at all because it's not here. Jumping has nothing to do with gravity. Present your gravity. What? Where? What is the element within and resides in y'all mass that emits y'all gravity? 
if you can't point me in the direction of this element, your gravity doesn't exist. And me coming back down to the ground doesn't have anything with it to do with your gravity. Or even when I drop anything, my remote, controller, a toy for my kids, anything. It doesn't have nothing to do with your gravity. Because no one here today or any time in, in history, in, in our whole lives, in the whole history since they proclaimed the earth was a ball, no one has been able to present any physicalities behind gravity. No one. Still to this day, and it is the year 2022. Now they're trying to say there's water in their space. But we being knew it was water in space. But the moon is actually right here. But they trying to put this now, y'all, on the internet, that there's a little bit of water in space. But shouldn't that be impossible because vacuum... You know, a vacuum. Yeah, what's up, man? Supposed to be a vacuum, so how can water be there? It should literally boil and evaporate. Seriously. What's going well, there, on? there is there there is three different forms of water, right? Ice, vapor, and liquid form. They will all do the same. But sir, can you present any evidence behind gravity? To prove uh, that? No, I want can't. to finish this debate, you know, maybe you guys can finally defeat me. <laughs> so we we can't uh, really get to the bottom of that, right? Because it is a, um, if it was to be real, it's an invisible substance, right? But how about this? Can we see oxygen that our lungs need? That has nothing to do with gravity. Sir, is there anything you could present to us right here, right now on this live, sir, that people can literally stand behind and believe that gravity exists by you presenting some physical evidence behind gravity? No, you can't. So gravity doesn't exist, sir. Do you still believe in gravity, even though you know you can't and no one's ever presented you any physical evidence behind it? Um... I see what you mean, but I also, but I don't understand the concept of magnets. It doesn't matter, sir. Go ahead and do you some homework so you can learn on it. Teach yourself. Never listen to no man. Remember that. Do you, do you believe in but, Jesus? Um, it doesn't matter. We're talking about science here. We're going to stay stick to this for now. <laughs> All right. But um, is there any way you may be able to present gravity in a physical form? If not, then gravity doesn't exist. Have a good one, man. Thought so. Take care, man. My question. You can see, no one can nor will ever be able to defeat me. Flat Earth Stepper, debunk the globe every and any time you see me live. Period. This is what I do. Magnets demonstrate mass affecting mass. All day, every day, any day. They have nothing to present for us, to us, behind their globe, nothing but claims. We have yet to still see, literally, we have yet to see live feed footage of the whole globe that they proclaim is here. How is this? We're in the year 2022. Appreciate the gifts, brother. This is the year 2022, y'all. Nothing? But the people still is just accepting all of this. They have no proof, no nothing behind their claims. The moon is resting. In order for the moon to rest, it takes oxygen and water. There's water in space now, in their space, in their vacuum. They proclaim and say it is only it is. Nothing else, nothing more, nothing less. Now, there's water in their space. Appreciate the love. Appreciate it. What's going on, y'all? Didn't I tell y'all? Space is what? Water. I told everybody this. The moon is not in space, though. The moon's right here in our local atmosphere. No game. Beneath the firmament. Yeah. Oh, and the Bible told y'all the earth is flat. Yeah, it did. Genesis 2. And the earth was without form. It wasn't a circle. It wasn't a sphere. It didn't do it say the earth was a sphere. No. Genesis 2 do not say the earth was a circle. Genesis 2 do not say 
the earth was the shape of a ball. Genesis 2 does not say any of this. Hi. Um, What's going on? I'm over knowledge. here kicking knowledge. I'm kicking knowledge. Y'all believe the uh, gravity guys... exists? You said what? Hey. I'm kicking knowledge on my Can life. Do y'all believe gravity exists? No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can I? Can you can prove I tell gravity you exists though? in a physical form? Yes. Watch this. That is not gravity. Can you prove gravity exists in a physical form? Can you present gravity to us in a physical form? That has nothing to do with gravity. That has everything to do with electromagnetism. It's going down. Can you prove gravity exists Bro, in a what, physical what form? What magnet? What is magnetic? Why is the moon resting? Part? Why is the moon resting? Hell. In order for the moon to April, rest, it takes we're oxygen all and water. Do you see me resting? Eventually, we're going to be all crazy down this, old. And, and not see done. nothing logical. Miss, why is the moon resting? In order for the moon to rest, it takes oxygen and water. How is this happening? Why is the sun growing? Answer the question. Why is know. the sun growing? You have no answer, I thought. So can you literally demonstrate? You have no answer either. Tell me why the sun is growing. Hey, no, the sun is right here in our local atmosphere. Why? What is that? What is the black spot How on the sun? How are you going to tell me the sun's not Bro, growing? Miss, what is the black spot on the sun? Bro, he talking about the moon resting. What moon? We have so many moons. The one that we see? Yeah. What? You have hey. not done your research. How many moons do we have? How many moons we got, y'all? Sheesh. I ain't did my research. Okay. Whoa. Boy, I'll tell you, this this stuff is written in hey man. I don't I don't I told y'all. But I tell y'all. People are this is how many moons we got? I know I Fine. I could have sworn last time I checked we got one moon. So why why is the moon rusting? Yes, yeah, sir, sir. Why why what's going on with the moon, man? They said it's in space. I'm a flat earther. I say the moon is right here in our local atmosphere. And that is the only way the moon can rest. You know, there is a, a pass in the Apocalypse of the Bible that says that the moon will turn red. Yeah, that's cool, sir. Sir, is there any answer you have for us here today, sir, why the moon is resting? Yeah, that's my answer. Oh, okay. You have a good one. That's no answer. See if the next guest may uh, be able to bring something. Mm. Hey, how you doing? I'm good. How hello. Hey, hello. Yeah, how you doing? Oh, I'm doing good. I'm doing good. I'm doing good. Um, I'm here to support you, but I'm going to give you a theory for those next fools who try to uh, <laughs> tell you something. <laughs> it's just simple. These scientists tell you all the time, okay? When they say planet Earth, right? Planet, plan, plan, meaning the plane, the flat earth, and the net, meaning the globe, the part that's over us. So you are absolutely right. It's flat with a with a dome on top. That's what the net is. No, so, planet actually means plane of terrain. No, I'm saying like the net, planet. Yeah, no, I get it. That means yeah. plane of terrain, though. Planet means plane of terrain. They, that's what the T stands for. Mm -hmm. Terrain. All right, brother, you take it easy. No problem. You be careful out there. Okay. Um, I have a question. Uh, I have an answer. So, um, if it says the moon is rusted, it says the How moon is you? rusting. How old are you? I'm eleven. That's too young. Oh, she was slick trying to sneak her kid on here to try to get a brother Baron. Uh, okay. I'm completely with you with this. The way that I'm... I'm with you getting off too young, too, my guy. No disrespect. Hey, what's going on? All right, all right. We got the silence Bob on here. We got silence Bob, silent Bob in the building. Okay, okay. Oh, okay, yeah, you know, yeah, I told y'all, you see, 
Nobody has any answers. The moon is resting. The earth is flat. They cannot defeat me. I am the flat earth step of flat earth king. You hear me, man? Can't nobody come up here and prove their globe earth in no type of sort or any way. I do this when I get on this here live and do my thing. Yeah, I'm going to prove this all the way. Hey, let's get a 10-second power tap. Everybody, just double tap your screen for 10 seconds one time so they don't try to suspend or being banned alive. You know what I'm talking about? That's really what it's all about, y'all. Let's just get a 10-second power tap in here, man. That's what it's all about here. This algorithm stuff, this is how it goes. This is really what's going on. But as long as y'all showing love and everybody, act, you know, they're seeing that people are liking the content, they won't let nothing happen to it. They think we don't know. Yeah, we gonna, this is what everybody, when y'all go live on y'all lives, do this as well. You know, every now and then, just ask everybody, period. Hey, can y'all, you know, just tap the screen a little bit? This is how you don't get suspended. This is how you stop that suspension. <clears throat> I had to figure it out. I had to figure it out. We all about to know. Period. No one can prove any of these claims, y'all. The moon is resting. Why is this? Because the moon is literally here. No one. Hey, how you doing, youngster? Hey, uh, what's up? I see you, man. Yeah, mother. Yeah, mother. Y'all be careful, man. Peace, love, and harmony to y'all. Gum, gum. I don't do the Thank game. <laughs> that was cool, though. Yeah, man. Genesis 2 debunks the whole globe. Genesis 2 debunks the whole globe. No game. No game. I mean, we all know this. I've, heard, I've read it time and time again. But, though, if I ask anybody on here, can you literally demonstrate and present your gravity right here to me through allotropy? No one can. All I'm asking is, can you demonstrate gravity to me in two different forms? That's it. That's all that means. Can you demonstrate gravity in two different in two different forms? That's all. Because here on flat Earth, we have magnets and electromagnets. I can literally demonstrate that in two different forms, and I can keep on adding. Truly. But when it comes to the globe, they have nothing. Then I ask, can you give me the element that resides within your mass? Give me the element that resides within your mass that emits this gravity. There's no element, there's nothing because there is no gravity. It don't exist, it's just a hoax. It's a foul, it's a story. We're not buying the wolf tickets no more. Present to us evidence or we don't wanna hear it. We done with the shenanigans. We the people, we about to take it all back. We snatching this up, period. They have nothing behind any of these lies. They been. Hey, what's up, bro? What's going on, man? Hey, do you believe the earth is a ball or is it flat? The earth is flat, bro. You trying to do a match? Okay, that's what I'm talking about. I'm talking about straight up. Yeah, straight you, up, what'd you say though? You trying to do a match? Do a, no, no, I ain't trying to do no matches, man. I'm just, I'm just kicking knowledge on this thing. Um, oh, wait, hold on. Hold on. Don't, don't run off too fast, baby. What the fuck? Oh, my. Good lord. Shit. <clears throat> wow. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. I ain't playing with y'all. That's stupid ass shit. What's going on, man? What's up, bro? How you doing? What's up? Huh? How you doing? Oh, I'm doing great, man. I'm a flat earther, man. I don't, yeah, I don't believe in that globe earth stuff. What the fuck? Why? Don't cuss on my live again. I'm going to have to let you down. It's my choice. That's why. Can you prove gravity exists? Can you present it in a physical form? No. So why would you be laughing up here talking about some what the F? Why? Do you believe the earth is flat? Sir, why would you be laughing on my live talking about some what the F? Why when you can't even present gravity in a physical form? What you believe in and what you follow in? Uh, I follow religion. 
You follow religion? Which religion are you? Uh, Christian. That's cool. That's cool. Who do you follow in your Christian religion? What do you mean? Who do you follow in your Christian religion? Did you ever question your religion? No. Why would I? Well, you should. Why? Why not? Why wouldn't you, though? Why well, me ask you this? Why wouldn't you question your religion? Why wouldn't you? Because it's part of my culture. Who created that religion? Uh, our people. Once again, sir, who creates it, that religion? I told you, my people, huh? Satanist. Who? Satanist. Satanist? Yeah, Satanists, people that, you know, atheists. Yeah, them. They the ones that created that religion. You don't know about it? King James and his people, that's what they were. You don't know that? Uh, I speak Aramaic, bro, so when I read the Bible, I read it in Aramaic. That's cool. That's cool. That's cool. So, who is who is Sar Shalom? Who? Who is Sar Shalom? I don't know, man. Are you trolling me? No, I'm not. Who, who, who is that? You never broke down that word in the Bible, sir? Sar Shalom? Have you ever seen that word in the Bible? Have you, yeah, have you no. ever seen this word in the Bible? No, not in the Aramaic Bible, no. Yeah, I won't talk to liars. No one can prove anything. Y'all can't prove me wrong. I promise you. Nobody can come up here and prove me to be wrong. I promise you. Hello, brother. How are you? I am great. I am great. How you doing? I'm good. I'm good. I'm a Christian, yeah? What do you think? I'm talking science right now, sir, not religion. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Religious TikTok. I'm pretty sure you know that. We're talking science here right now. Okay, okay. You knew that, though. You see that the my post is about the moon resting, not religion. Yeah, 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 yeah. But I, I'm kind of okay. thinking, what do you think? You have I'm... a great man, man. Why would you come on my live trying to talk about it? Those are the trolls. Those are just, those are people. Yeah. Look, everybody y'all see come on my live. And they try to talk about everything and anything but my topic I have posted behind me. They're the ones that's mad and they know they can't defeat me. So they, what they're trying to do is come up here and talk about everything and anything that doesn't have to do with my live. So people, my views will go down. That's all it's about. That's all they want to try to do. Crazy, they're weird, strange, but they cannot literally prove anything behind their gravity. Nothing, nothing, nothing. So, how is y'all moon resting, people? Y'all have anything? Y'all have no answers. Yeah, it's from two years ago, and they still haven't figured it out. This post is from two years ago, and they still haven't figured it out. Moon is iron, and hey, I'm having. Mm -hmm. Try to tell everybody it was um, you know, yeah, it was something a little different, eh? You feel me? Yeah. I'm just saying though. Y'all ain't got nothing? Nah, I'm a flat earther. What y'all got? Well. Flat earth. I done I done, I done defeated every gloober that jumped up here on my live. Will you be defeated too, sir? You might be. Sir, how you doing? I'm good. Um I might be defeated. I don't know if you kick me. If you don't like what you hear, I guess. Uh, no, um, you don't have that factual answer. You're defeated. Uh, yeah. Are you familiar with the Cavendish experiment? That's debunked due to electromagnetic waves. How did they know that those are waves, though? Yeah, no problem. Stick around. What? Give me a second. Don't you worry. Mm -hmm. Like, where the heck my papers go? Hell on out. Good Lord. Oh, my bad. Here we go, sir. Here we go. In the 1960s, this, oh, this is a published done by Lynn B. Wilson. In the 19, this is 
this was discovered in the 60s too, man. In the 1960s, scientists discovered a new kind of shockwave that traveled through space and plasma. Okay, what does this have to do with the Cavendish experiment? Oh, this shockwave, you know what I'm talking about? It literally has an effect on every and anything here on the Earth. This shockwave is the magnetic effect that emits through the air and literally pulls us down. It's the magnetic force from the Earth. That's not what you just read. <laughs> Where does it say that in the, what you just read? This shockwave, sir. Wait, show me this. Yeah, it's on camera. Let me see. I ought to show you nothing. Go find it. Lynn B. Wilson. But it's go right in front of you. Uh, you I'll, I'll go, I'll go look it up. But if it's literally right in front of you, I, I want to believe what you me. say. That's the point. I want you to think and use your own brain. Build your own perspective behind this. Look up Lynn B. Wilson. And then you go do your work. Wait, how do I spell it? Lynn B. Wilson in the 1960s, a scientist discovered a new kind of shockwave that traveled through space plasmas that did not rely on collisions. Thus, they are known as collisionless shockwaves. These shocks are great interest in multiple fields of research. They can produce radiation that can negatively yeah, impact commercial and military spacecraft operations as well as the safety of humans in space. What does, that have to do with the, and, what does that have to do with the Cavendish experiment? Oh, don't worry about it, sir. Don't worry about it, sir. Let me read this other one, too. But that, okay, that that source had nothing to do with the that, Cavendish experiment. Do you know what that shockwave actually is? I'm asking, do you know? Because all you said was, oh, yeah, it affects us, but. <laughs> yeah, it does. It does. Let me show you. Let me tell you how. The shockwave, literally. Do you know what comes out of magnets? No, explain. Shockwaves. This is Shockwave. how they actually attract to one another. Yeah. Did you know that? No. No, you didn't. I know you didn't, sir. And this is how and why your test is debunked. But let me break down electromagnetism for you, too, as well. So maybe. But that's not what the better. paper you read just said, but okay. It don't matter. I'm reading it to you so you can have a standing behind shockwaves. Yeah. And it's shockwaves. Any shockwaves is what it do. What you just did is called extrapolation, but okay. Work. Anyway, electromagnetism science is the charge of the force and fields associated with charge. Electricity and magnetism are two aspects of electromagnetism responsible for far more than just electricity and magnetism. It is the force that binds negatively charged electrons to positively charged electrons. So what where's your gravity? <sighs> oh, where's gravity? Yeah, where's your gravity? They're, they didn't say nothing about gravitrons. Gravitron? What are you talking about? <laughs> you know what I'm talking about, sir. You heard it before. They didn't say the anything gravitrons? about gravitrons. The gravitrons doesn't exist. So if the gravitrons don't exist, sir, your gravity had no effect in that Cavendish experiment. A gravitron? Did you hear me? Should I say it again? I feel like I feel like sometimes like we just make up words, right? And then like we believe those words. You've never heard the word gravitron? You go type it in on your science. Ever, page. yeah, yeah. I wrote, I wrote a ride. What about electromagnetized? You ever heard of that? Yeah, I've heard of that. Right, right. Have you ever heard of gravitomagnetism? <laughs> no. What? Explain that for me. Gravitomagnetism? <laughs> Say less. Yeah, this is what your science field is looking for to prove gravity actually exists. You didn't know that? You didn't know that, sir? No, can you keep explaining? I like this. I like learning more. Are you serious? I think you trolling. Yeah, now. of course. I'm serious. I swear, I think you are trolling. A lot of y'all just come. Oh, up I'm, by I'm not trolling. trolling. No, I'm not trolling. You try to come up here and ask questions that don't have nothing to do with anything. You ain't proving nothing on your end. All you doing is coming up here trying to question electromagnetism. All your questions, you can go teach yourself. What you asking me for? Why are you coming to trust another man? What you doing? Okay, so if anything I said, you don't trust, right? Sir, we're having a debate. You come but I'm expected to trust you. What you say? Oh, oh. So this is a debate, right? So oh, yes. I, am, am I allowed to? Flat Earth, or you're global, right? Wait. So I'm allowed to in a debate. Typically, you're allowed to test another person's like logic or like their consistency. No, we ain't having your global Earth debate. We have a flat Earth debate because you can't prove gravity exists. I said the Cavendish experiment. Debunked. Oh yeah, and then you labeled a source that had nothing to do with the Cavendish experiment. It don't matter what you say, sir. Can you prove gravity exists in a physical form or your Cavendish experiment is debunked anyway? Yeah, the Cavendish experiment. Prove gravity exists in a physical form. Mm, it's viewable, yeah. 
in the electro the electromagnetic waves, literally. Wait, can you view electromagnetic the waves? Sir, one second, let me finish. See those they waves? Emit from the earth. They emit from the earth. They had an effect on that test. Yeah, can you can you see them? They emit from the earth. They had an effect on that. But how test. do you know if you can't see them? Science literally said in the 1960s they discovered them. Wait, so that science is okay, but my science isn't. Your science has too many holes in it. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, people are saying that they looked up your source and said that they found nothing. They ain't looked up the right place. That's why it's their fault. Period. Wait, so look up you Lynn B. Wilson. What about so you don't know what about Faraday Clark Maxwell? You know about you know about Maxwell? No. Maxwell? I don't know. I don't know Maxwell. Nothing. Dude, I'm not trolling. What questions? You just want to come up here and try to ask questions, sir. You don't have nothing. But isn't that what a debate is? Like we go back and forth. I'm not having your little slow birth debate because you have no proof behind gravity. Until you present physical evidence behind gravity, you can't ask me nothing. Literally. Wait. I said the Cavendish experiment, and then you gave me a certain. Don't kick me, please. I'm, I'm begging. Like I like talking to you. <laughs> electromagnetic waves, literally flew out of the earth and was engaged in and interacting with that test so did you see those waves though they did who's they sir so what do you have for gravity though you keep trying who's to they? focus on your, your cabin just got debunked so what you got bro yeah they i'm still gonna say the cabin dish <laughs> well, it be, it's debunked due to land b wilson's discovery so okay so I'm going to ask you, what does that discovery have to do with Cavendish? You say electromagnetic waves. Sir, How do they see these waves? waves? Sir, one second, calm down. These waves emit from the earth. So if they are, if they are emitting from the earth, they're literally interacting with that Cavendish experiment. Literally. So have you, have you seen the Cavendish experiment? Have you seen the earth? Yeah, I'm looking at I'm I'm on the earth. I can see it. Right. You know how big it is? Yeah, it's pretty big. Yeah. So your little cabin dish test that ain't even the size of somebody's living room. Yeah. The earth grab, you know, electromagnetic waves are gonna have everything to do and they're gonna affect that in every in any way. Okay, so, so you know the uh, vacuum chamber test is actually debunked as well. They said they use a Faraday cage. Did they have a Faraday cage the size of the Earth? No. Yeah, so that's debunked. <clears throat> Do you know what, like, experiment of scale is? Yeah, that's why they needed a Faraday cage the size of the Earth. Mm, mm, mm. And that no, but you can a, create a replica. That actually that's wouldn't like... that even stop the shock waves from the electromagnetic field, you know that? Because these waves actually stretch out into space and go through plasma. So how do we stop these waves? So if these waves go through plasma, sir, how did it not affect your Cavendish experiment? No, I'm, I'm willing to entertain this, but like, how do we stop these waves then? To have like a fair study. Sir, once again, if these waves, sir, if these waves go through plasma, how did they not affect your Cavendish experiment? Wait, am I, am I still here? Yeah, yeah, yeah I'm, I'm asking you. you how, no yeah, I, I want to do the Cavendish experiment, but let's let's do it without the waves. So how do we again, cancel I'm the waves? You again, I'm gonna ask you again, sir. I'm gonna ask you again. If these waves go through plasma, how could they have not affected your Cavendish experiment? Where are these waves coming from? Ask the, well, I'm letting you down. This man's done. Are you beat? Are you, I feel like I feel like you're a broken man. Am I what? You have no answer. I feel like you're broken, sir. You have no answer. All you're Am asking I is where did broken? these come from? What what are these waves? It's because you're saying this debunks no mine. Answer. So now I have to question your source, right? Yeah, you. That's what that's you're how saying. a debate works. Sir, sir, sir. These waves go through plasma. They literally had an effect on the Cavendish test. Yeah, so like the way a debate works is I, I bring a source, you bring a counter source, I question your source, you question my source, right? Once again, you're we ain't having your debate. 
we having to debate the old way. Yeah, old times way. Unless you can present this. What, you want to fight? Is that what you're saying? You want to you want no, fist sir. fight? No, no. I'm saying you present your physical evidence behind your globe. And if you can't present anything that presents, that can come and be presentable to the people behind your evidence, behind gravity, or any physicalities, bro, I would never answer no questions you would ask me. Period. Y'all implied that after they bought the world out. Because they couldn't win. They had nothing. So, sir, can you present anything behind your gravity? Any physicalities? I would just say the Cavendish experiment. I mean, you can kick me now if you want, but... Shock waves debunk that? Anything else? Are you... Okay, well, how did they, de- how did they debunk? Because you're just saying they do it. How? Um, go, go and do it. Where do they answer. come from? Go do what are they? Go do your own homework. What do you have next, sir? Uh, it seems like you're broken. This is why I say you're broken. Well, you, you did the homework for me, so that's why I'm asking. So you're broken? You have no answers? No, I'm not broken. I'm asking. Right. You're asking questions. You have no answers. You're broken. Well, if you answer my questions, they would give me an answer. You're broken. Hey, what's up, my brother? How you doing? I'm doing great. I'm doing great. Just on here, you know, probing everybody around and try to come up here and prove and defend that their glow. <laughs> I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Um, the topic. I'm just curious. What is it? The moon is resting. What are they saying? What are they trying to claim? I don't know what they're saying. But I'm saying the moon is right here in our local atmosphere. Is nowhere what they're saying. Yeah, and uh, I'm I'm actually with you. I'm not contesting that. I got I got video evidence to prove that on my own phone. So, yeah, I'm with you. <laughs> that's cool. That's cool. I I'm, I got questions though because I still don't understand what the moon actually is. Right? Like I get the sun being electromagnetic and holding itself you being this energy. Homework to do, my boy. You yeah, I do. I definitely I do. I can't tell you, right? Hey. Huh? What'd you say? What'd well, you I said say, I, didn't create, I didn't create the moon, right? Yeah, well, someone did. That's my right. that's my opinion so far. I know. Am I God? Maybe. No. <laughs> Do y'all some homework. We're coming up here asking people questions, huh? What y'all talking about? Oh, hey, can some, hey, somebody jump in the box that got a PhD. Get up here that got a PhD. Anybody that got a PhD. Prove to y'all none of this stuff. It's all this stuff they've been teaching to show these people. It's nothing. All trash. Get in the box. Anybody that has a PhD, get in the box. Straight up. Get in the box. <laughs> I was, can, can we get somebody up here with a PhD? Hmm? Yeah. Come on up here, mate. <laughs> in the box. Let's get someone up in here, man, with some of these. Great, great. With some of this great schooling they proclaim and think is great up under the belt, they think. Hmm. Anybody? Where y'all at? Where y'all at? Huh? Nothing? Nobody? There's never nobody. Who got an answer? Anybody got an answer? Huh? What you got? What y'all got? You gotta have more than a thousand followers to get up here. Can you anybody present gravity in a physical form? No one. I told you. No, y'all can't. Do y'all gravity have a body plan? Body plan means basic architectural arrangement of a biological structure, which can be gas. Does it? No. Is is plastic magnetic? Yes. 
Do you know plastic actually can and yeah, it does actually derive from clay. You can make plastic out of clay. Did you know that? Yeah. Earthly material composed mainly of hydrous aluminum, silicates, and other minerals, which is plastic when moist, but hard when fired. Is wood magnetic? Hell yeah, wood is magnetic. You know what I'm talking about, man? Wood is magnetic through heat induction. You know, dig and stand all the way, though. Sheesh. Oh, my. Mm, mm, mm. This is unbelievable, y'all. Earth is flat once again. Where can you go read and see that the earth is flat? In Genesis 2. Straight up. Yeah. In the beginning. In the beginning. What time is it? Can't okay, see the time. This white thing all in the back. I'm starting to feel a little tired of time. Yeah. And the earth was without form. The earth was without form. He didn't say the earth was a ball. He didn't say the earth was round. He didn't say the earth was a sphere. He didn't say the earth was a circle. The earth was without form. A sphere is form. That's a form. So what's going on here, people? Yeah, okay. And void and darkness was upon the face of the deep. What do they tell y'all about space? Deep space? Deep space? Void and darkness was upon the face of the deep. Deep space. Sheesh. And what is inside the void and darkness of the deep? What was there inside the void and darkness of the deep? And the spirit, a.k.a. Holy Ghost, of God moved upon the waters. Moved upon the face of the water. So, literally, the Bible just let us know the void and darkness of the deep, which is space. There is water. God moved upon the face of the water. Which is in the void and the darkness of the deep. Space is water. Literally. There ain't no vacuum. It's right there in the book. Right there. And the earth was without form. Not a sphere. Not a circle. Not a ball. No. Without form. A flat terrain. It got to be flat. That's what it means. And void and darkness was upon the face of the deep, deep space. And the spirit of God moved upon the face of the water. Space is water. The void, the dark, and the deep, that is deep space. There's waters out in the space. This is why when we see them try to shoot that rocket off, we see them grind against the firmament and the waters react right behind them. We see it all the time, man. Eh? All the time. We see this. It's nothing new to us. Nothing new. Oh, this right here in the Bible. Yeah, right here in the Bible. What's the point of people coming alive to be like? Man, it's crazy. Yeah, it's right here in the Bible. And the earth was without form, and the void and darkness was upon the face of the deep. And the Spirit of God moved upon the waters. Hello. Do y'all ever see people do this on other people's lives this often? Yo, I do that. Y'all ever see these people on other people's lives? Y'all ever see people troll people this much and this series is yeah, hard on other people's lives? Do y'all ever see this? I want y'all to pay attention. Open your eyes up to what's happening here on my live. These people ain't coming up here bringing and presenting nothing factual, no evidence, nothing that even holds any weight. 
They jump in my box just to troll because nobody can prove me wrong. No one. How you doing, sir? Yeah, man, I'm a good man. Yeah. You, you believe that on the ground? You believe that yeah, ground, sir? Yes, man. Do you present gravity in a physical form? Yes, and the earth was without form. The earth was not a sphere. God did not make the earth as a sphere. No, he said the earth was without form. Earth is flat. Earth is flat. Earth was without form. You can say the earth was a circle. The earth was a sphere. No, the earth was a ball. Nope, it says the earth was without form. In order for something to be a sphere, it has to take the form of a sphere. Hello. <laughs> and voided darkness was upon the face of the deep. What is the deep, deep space? Yeah. The spirit, a.k.a. Holy Ghost of God, moved upon the face of the waters. Space is water. I've been telling y'all this all this time. Space is water. Didn't I tell y'all this? Space is water. Yeah. Understand this, learn it, and get with it. If you don't believe it and you don't think so, then pre present gravity in a physical form. If you can't, the earth is flat. Straight like that. Present gravity in a physical form for you. To, that's the only way you can prove me wrong. Oh, I'm big for real. Flat hey, earth are all the way. Go, go visit my page. What's going on, man? Okay, okay. So you got to like look at the a bigger picture of within the universe itself and how that works so and how that also, in physical form okay. or none of what you believe or what you say it's is real flames it's it's both physical and non-physical energy makes up literally everything that's why it can't be destroyed nor created and it's it's sticky to itself it attracts to itself sir, it changes sir, all and so as it re as it Hey brother, groups, hey, if it, as stop it just groups. talking on my live, sir. Stop just talking before I kick you off. Stop just talking. I don't want to hear a monologue. Sir, all energy comes from somewhere. Tell me the element that emits, that your gravity is emitting from. Elements are atoms, correct? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> atoms don't emit gravity. Sir, can you tell us? Uh, element so magnets don't emit any Mag magnets aren't gravity but uh, uh i'm saying they're they do something that's the point and atoms flow through them do you know that and electrons and um anyway can that's, you that's not how gravity way? works can you explain I how gravity it works to me don't work can you present gravity in a physical form because yes be I don't uh, know what they're called, but there's certain there's certain quarks that are attracted to each other, and those quarks are those forms of energy. Sir, once again, sir, it's it's literal energy. That's it's fine. it's sir, it's the point. base of what sir, creates. Stop talking when I'm speaking. Stop doing that, brother. I'm gonna let you down. I'm Can sorry. Point I us just, in the direction to... of an element. I'm gonna let you down. I'm gonna do it again. I'm gonna let you down. Like it's your only end. It's your first and last one. Can you point us in the direction of the element that emits gravity? Specific elements do not emit gravity. Exactly. So if there's no element that emits it, it doesn't exist. And we can even do better than that. Does your gravity have a body plan? Well, it's it's not the element that emits gravity. It's 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 what makes the element is what creates gravity. It's gravity not the element itself. The element. Every element. Sir, does your gravity have a body plan? What do you mean by body plan? Every, every in that case, every atom emits gravity. 
No, it doesn't. Can't prove that. Sir, body plan means does the gravity have architectural arrangement of a biological structure, which can be gas? No, because it's 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 sent out in all directions. If you look at a star explode, all the energy from that is sent out in directions. When light is sent out, it's sent out in all equal directions. Sounds good, sir. Sir, so you just said no. Do you know by you saying no, you just literally admitted that gravity was never created within the Big Bang. Thank you, sir. Because it was not even no, a part of gas. Correct. And gas was during the Big Bang. So if gravity was never ever created during the Big Bang, it was never even brought into existence. That's because the Big Bang never happened. True that. <laughs> so glad you know that. And now let's the really big, get to the it. big bang. So can you oh, can you perform gravity in front of anyone here on this live, sir, through a logical? What do you mean by that? Just can you literally you just dropping? Can anything? you present? Let me let me answer for you. Thank you. Can you present to us gravity through two different forms? Define form because do you mean like you a know live the word form means, sir? Can you do that or no, sir? Yes or no? Yes or no, well, sir? Well, you have the you have the opposite when energy is put into something. We want physical it, forms. Physical forms. Can you perform your gravity in front of us, sir, through a latrope? No, because you would need t super, super electronic microscopes. No, because your gravity don't exist. Sir, can you point me in the direction once the scientists way you, you, they're going to call it elect they're going to call it gravitomagnetized? Can you point me in the direction of this element to prove gravity exists? Well, it's not a specific element that every element puts out gravity. So, no, you can't. Well, up if you go up up higher up, I've done this in planes. Uh, yeah, at free falling, gravity nor the elements, sir. Can you point us? No, no, no. If you put two things, element. if you put two things together up there, they'll they fall into each other. That's cool, sir. The, can you prove it has something to do with gravity by pointing us in the direction of the element that every element, every for gravity? Where is my you can't you can't world? physically show what gravity is because it's it's. It's it's an attraction of energy together, and you can't. It's not a physical one. It's a one of space and time, because everything takes up a physical space and time in our dimension of our existence. That sounds good. That sounds good. Can you prove that? Anyway, no. By presenting gravity. The best. Energy. The best. The best way to put it out is if you have a giant round table. But it's all a fabric cloth. If you if you if you show the gravitational weight on it, and if you put whatever you put on there, it it pulls to each other. But that's an exaggerated form of that, because that that's on a much bigger, bigger scale. That has everything to do with electromagnetism. Oh, there we go. Okay, yeah, that has everything to do with electromagnetism. That doesn't have anything to do with your gravity, sir. Not at all. Nothing. Electro, how did stuff going down to the earth being attracted so to electromagnetism? Each other has to do Until with you can prove gravity exists in a physical form, it's all due to electromagnetism. Literally. Literally. So you're saying electricity is attracting everything down to the earth? Electromagnetism is just not electricity, sir. There's more to it. You might want to go do some homework on that. Sir, can you prove that gravity exists in a physical form, though? I'm going to have to let up the next guess. Yes, by what makes up the universe, thank you. No, that's not that's if you true. if you if you break down what quarks are made of, yes. No, that's not the answer either, sir. That's not what science says. Science doesn't even know. Oh, we left. Alright. Yeah. Hello, hello. 
What's the point of coming on my live just to troll? I don't understand. Y'all see this? Let me, hey, I'm going to keep on And Then I'll be actually sitting on TikTok. I'll be on other people's lives and stuff. But I do not ever see nobody else's lives getting as many trolls as I get. Okay, so anyways. Ever. Stuff spinning in the middle of anything will attract something to go towards it, right? Can you prove gravity exists in a physical form, sir? Here on Flat Earth, we have magnets. What do you have? <laughs> okay. So, if, if you have something spinning, like a tire... Sir, why are you still talking about that? Once again, here on Flat Earth, we have magnets. What do you have? I'm going to have to let you down. You're just going to say magnets is everything? What do you have? I have... Like you got the core spinning at a, like at a huge rate. That has nothing. Once again, if you don't have anything you can present physically. Oh, man. You, you, okay, let me go then. True. You're stupid. You know you're done here already. Boy, couldn't even, you couldn't even come up here and say anything. You ain't having no more of that nonsense. Hey, how you doing? How you doing, man? How you doing? I'm doing <clears throat> great, man. Here on Flat Earth, we have magnets that literally demonstrate mass affecting mass. What can you put in my hand physically, sir, that will demonstrate only gravitons is flowing through it, and it is gravity emitting from it, and it is gravity affecting or demonstrating mass affecting mass? What can you put Shouldn't in my hand? Fly. Obviously. Once again, sir, so what can you put in my hand? What can you put in my hand behind gravity, sir? I believe in what you believe in. That's great. What's going on? Yeah, man. How you doing? How you doing? Yeah, man. I'm literally I'm just just coming up to um just try and understand that um where where you, where this is? I've just joined, by the way. That I've been here like less than five minutes, not even that. But um, I know, I know what I've been taught traditionally of how all of it happens. If that makes sense. But Sir, can you with, present like, gravity in the form? Magnets and stuff like that. Yeah. So Sir, you present gravity in physical form. Stop talking. I'm gonna have to let you down. Sorry. Can you present gravity in a physical form? What do you mean? The question is, the moon is rust. All right. Uh, good morning. Hey, how you doing? Um, I just wanted to ask about why, what happens with the magnets you talk about, because I don't understand. It don't matter, sir. Can you prove gravity exists? Okay. Um, the thing about gravity is it affects everything, right? Yeah. Uh, from what I know, magnets only come from like metals being electro, like electromagnetic. Well, sir, can you present gravity to us right here, right now, today, in a physical form? Can you do that? Or everything. Gra no, gravity isn't physical. Gra gravity isn't physical. Same thing with so magnets, too. Physical. Magnets aren't physical. Like, but any form of magnetism isn't physical. Magnets are physical. physical. You can hold them in your hand. What can you give me behind gravity that I can hold in my those, hand? Those are metals that have magnetic properties. It's Sir, a property of a uh, metal. Are you listening? No. The are thing, the way... I'm going to have to let you down, then, if you're not listening. Sir, listen. It's magnets I can physically hold in my hand. What can you place in my hand that I can physically hold behind gravity? You know, uh, if you, to magnets you hold, yeah, let's talk about size. Uh, sorry, I, I'm not trying to... Damn, you have no answer. You have a great one. Hey, what up, bro? How you doing? How you doing? I'm straight, dog. So you asking... Uh, how to present uh, gravity in a physical form? Yeah, you understand it, dig? Because here on Flat Earth, you know what I'm talking about, man? Say, man, we over here digging and rolling around with these here magnets. You understand it, dig? What I'm saying? I feel you, bro. I'm the thing about yeah, all the way, man. 
the thing about gravity though, it's it's a theory. You feel me? Like it, it can't really. We don't have the means to prove it just yet. You know what I'm saying? So you saying give me something physical to prove it? We it's the you year can't do that. 2022. How long they been saying gravity been in existence? A long as I feel you, bro. I'm right there with you. But y'all still ain't got nothing behind it, nothing forward. Like, come on, bro. We ain't Shit. buying these whoop tickets no more, though. You in the D? Straight like so, that, man. So, something physical to prove it. You feel You really can't do that. <laughs> to, you know, y'all ain't got nothing to present physical, though, bro. Ski, we ain't buying it no more. Take them whoop tickets back to the college of things. I'm, yeah, them square bears gonna buy them. You feel me? We ain't with it, though, though. I'm with it, bro. Take I feel you, bro. You, you feel me? You saying, so, you said Flat Earth, too, right? Oh, yeah, flat earth, man, all the way, the only way, you know what I'm talking about, because so the you, earth can't, can't, won't be nothing else, man, because can't nobody even prove none of that, though. So what's happening with so it? So you, you talking about the feminine, the feminine and shit like that? No, nah, I'm just talking about gravity, you feel me? So with um flat earth, you you know about Argatha, anything like that? or I know gravity don't exist. It don't? I mean... You feel me? Can you prove that it don't exist, though? You feel me? Yeah, because we got magnets. What you got physically behind gravity, bro? bro. I'll say this, though. How magnets disprove gravity? What you got physically behind gravity, bro? I'm uh, saying we not- can't prove it. I'm saying we can't prove it nor de- uh, or uh, deny it. You know what I'm saying? It's one of the things uh, no, that we, we can can't- deny it because you can't prove it. So why wouldn't I deny something you can't prove? I know God exists because no scientists can't make the earth. You know what I'm talking about? That's no true. Make the earth. You feel me? So I know God exists. You know what I'm talking about all the way, though, man. Nobody can get in the way of that. They can just try to make their little fake false claims. But, yeah, though, the real truth is gravity don't exist. Nobody can prove gravity exists because you can't present it or <clears throat> give me the element gravity is emitting from. So what's going on with this stuff? So can I ask you a question? What's happening? So, like, do you do you think, like, uh, atoms and molecules and elements and shit like that exist? Out of them, of course. Like, what? So, so with atoms and shit, the way they they bond together, they make molecules and whatever. You know what I'm saying? And the same force to tell these atoms to bond together to make this iron or to make this carbon or to make whatever. You know what I'm saying? It could be the same thing behind gravity. It's a force that you can't see, that you can't even prove. You know what I'm saying? But we here right now. Do you know that? Uh, do you know that that all actually has to do literally? With electromagnetic energy. Yeah. Yeah. Gravity might have to do with the same thing though. No, it don't. I'm gonna have to let you down now. What's that in there? What's up? What's up? Can you hear me? What's rock? Yeah, I can hear you loud and clear, Jack. All right. So, gravity. So, you want a physical form of gravity, right? Yeah, Jack. All right. So, there's a scientific experiment that has been done before, but I'll explain how it works. So, metals, yeah, not well, all metals, for example. Jack, Jack, don't play about the monologue on my live, Jack. You hear me, Jack? Jack, right. come up here. I'm going to get physical quick. Physical evidence that there. You're going to dig and You're about to get up out of here. Yeah. Okay, physical form, lead. Lead is not magnetic. That's got to do with gravity, Jack. It is magnetic, actually, Jack, to a certain extent, Jack. You know that. To a certain extent, but... Yeah, Jack. What? You heard me, Jack. But what does that mean? That doesn't mean it's going to stay on the Earth. If you stick a magnet to your body, it's not going to stay. Once again, to a certain extent. Hey, Jack, what you got behind gravity, Jack? Oh, I can explain that gravity is more powerful than magnetism. No, it is not, Jack. That's the weakest force yes, that you put on the... Boy, it is. Boy. I'll explain it. Yo, Jack. So, hey, Jack. Say, Jack. What you got behind your gravity, man? Demonstrate it in the physical form, or you have nothing. Okay. Take lead, a big and ball of lead. And why? And why, when they tested lead, there was no gravitrons flowing through it? Well, gravitrons aren't real. That's just that's hypothetical. That gravity has nothing to do with gravitrons. Gravi- like gravitrons what, whatever they use to. Me- Let me respond, brother. Okay, Stop go ahead, talking go ahead. so much. Go ahead. If they're not real, that means gravity has no energy. No, what I'm saying is when you take like a magnet like ometer and you are me- uh, testing magnetism, that that's like that you don't know what that gravity. actually is that's testing. You don't know what that's cool. actually testing. That's cool, what? bro. That's cool. Straight up on anything. That's cool. You feel me? What you got for gravity though, bro? You feel me? 
I just said, but you won't let me finish. So, for yeah, example, just talking about magnetism. But anyway, might bounce back to your gravity, though. Yeah. Okay. So for gravity, if you take yeah. a non-magnetic metal, yeah, 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 like uh lead, or for example, wood, which is not yeah, magnetic it's not, either. It's earth that is not magnetic because it all comes from the earth. That means it's magnetic to a certain extent. What you got for your gravity, man? So, like I said, I'm trying to explain. Gravity is a force that exists that is more powerful than magnetism. But you have to let me finish. Have you ever seen the elemental table for, sir? That, so are you talking about earth, water, fire, or periodic table? I'm talking about earth, water, fire. And do you know right there on that table at the bottom, they have gravity as the weakest force. Yeah, electromagnetism as the strong force. So what are you talking about? Don't come on my live trying to lie, my boy. No, 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 wait. All of a sudden, you believe in what the scientists tell you? I believe they tell you that gravity is real, though. You can't, you can't, no, you can't go based on what they say. Talking so much, my guy. Go ahead. I believe in nature, nature's elements. Yeah, this is where we can derive from. So where's your gravity in nature, though? You're talking about strong force and weak force, which includes gravity in nature. Yes, but what I'm saying, if you're saying that gravity is listed weaker than electromagnetics, that means gravity exists. Nature, that means gravity sir. exists. Okay, that's fine. Where? But you you just said that it existed. No, you're. You said it's listed on under electromagnetism, okay. and you said that you acknowledge it as weaker. Brother, stop talking. But so you much. just Jesus. said that it existed. That's cool. Let me respond and stop talking so much while I kick okay. you off my lies. Go ahead. They go put ahead. it there just as they made, just as they said and made a claim that gravity exists. Hello, they just put it there. Hello. So can you prove gravity exists? All right. Oh, okay. I'll, I'll, let me keep going. Like I said before, I've been asking you to let me finish. But what you did just say there was saying that gravity did exist. But I'll that keep going from my, from my position. It doesn't matter. From my position. So I what I was saying. Gravity was, in a physical form, sir, I'm going to have to let you down. Okay. I'm about to, I'm, okay. I'm about to say it, okay? You let me, can you let me finish? And I'm I don't want do no it. analog. So, I don't want no formula. Present okay. Gravity in a physical form. Lead, wood, water. Water is the best wood, form. Magnetic through heat induction. And then, Lead is like magnetic I said, to a certain extent. But gravity affects that lead much more because lead is not a ferromagnetic metal. You cannot make that's it into something crazy. that will stick to something else. Oh, that's great, sir. So, where is this gravity emitting from? From the lead or from whatever object that exists. To a stronger degree than the magnetism. And let me explain it. Let me explain it. Are let me you use telling water. me that's your best answer? Wait, wait, let me finish. You're not letting me finish. Listen, 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 listen. Okay, I'm going to just go ahead. The best way to describe it is water. But first off, with the lead, for example, what I was going to say is you take a big piece of it. It's not magnetic. You put a, a small one next to a big one. And then on Sorry. opposite sides, on a spinning like fan, and it'll move towards the bigger one. But with water... Sorry. Okay, can I finish? Hey, brother, brother, you're not okay, saying nothing, brother. I'm, I'm cutting you off. Can you wait, wait, wait. give us okay, something go behind gravity in a physical form? Don't include no other elements, just your gravity. No water, no air, nothing. Gravity. But you're asking for the element that is gravity, I'm and that's water. I'm you to point us, no, it's not. It, no. But I can explain that it is, if you let me do I that. I prove to you that it's not. I'm not about to let you know. Okay. I'm monologue. I'm Lie, because there's no gravitrons oh. in water. They're looking for gravitrons, sir, to prove gravity has energy. Let me finish, my guy. Okay, to go prove go ahead, gravity go emits and has energy. They're still looking for this to this day, literally. And they're literally looking for gravitomagnetism. Okay. Without them two keys, your gravity cannot exist. Okay, so how about I pose this? Gravitrons and gravitomagnetism are theories. Want a theory. We don't want a theory. I, they, they are theories. Those are theories. They're not real. What you're saying is a theory right here, right now. But gravity itself, like like magnetometers aren't real. You don't know what it's actually measuring. But magnetism is real. Their theory about magnetism is I not. Know. But when I take two magnets and put them together, that's real. I but the know. theory is not. Gravitrons are not real. That's what I'm trying to explain to you. But gravity is real. 
Huh? Gravity is fake. You have nothing gravity is real. No, okay. let me okay, explain it. Sir, let, let me, me talk. Stop talking okay, go ahead, so go much ahead. on my live, brother. Go ahead. I'm not about to be arguing on my live. I'm gonna just kick you off. Okay. Okay. Go ahead. Like you know this now, man. You cannot present your gravity in any physical form. You saying it's water. There's no gravitrons in water. There's no gravitrons anywhere. So how okay. does your gravity exist, Jack? What I'm saying is, if this is my... Can I talk now? Jack, I'm going to tell you right now, Jack, you ain't about to monologue. Don't give us no formula, Jack. We want physical... Okay, no formulas. Simple. Gravitrons physical are not related to gravity. Gravitrons have nothing to do with gravity. They are a theory. This. So how can you even say that, yes. brother? Come on, Jack. I agree. Gravity exists, but gravitrons are not related to gravity they're they're not gravity a thing don't exist sir gravity don't exist electricity relies on electrons everything but it doesn't it doesn't rely on electromagnetism <clears throat> do you know electrons flow through magnets yes but electricity doesn't rely on that magnetism does exactly Magnetism relies on the electricity. So if the electrons not the other way flow through magnets, and they get electrons give magnets their energy to do what they do, literally. Yes. Yes. So don't you need gravitron, sir, to give your gravity its energy to do what it's gonna do? What I'm trying to explain is. Okay, I'm gonna have to let you down. But we'll no, no, wait, 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 wait. No actual wait. evidence. No wait. Answers, uh, let me no explain. You're not letting me explain. I don't want let me explain. Nor your form. I won't give a monologue. I won't give a monologue. Can I? I can I give the physical the form and story. why it is gravity? I want your Winnie the Pooh story? I don't. I'm not buying your whoop tickets, bro. But you asked me to prove it. I can do it. Okay, it listen. Is. Give me, give me one minute. One minute. One minute. One minute. One minute. Your ass off my line. Didn't prove a thing. It was monologue. Yeah, so uh, I'm just wondering why you claim you're part of Jack Jack when you have no affiliation with Neo or anybody in the Jack Jack, buddy. No, Neo does not We can't even hear you, sir. You have a great night, sir. We don't even know what you're saying, brother. We can't even hear what you're saying. Hello. Yeah, what's up? We can't hear All you, right. sir. Would you like to try to speak up louder? I'm gonna have to let you down. I I I'm here, bro. Can you hear I can hear you a little. I'll give you. I'll give you a little better. I'll give you a little better. All right. So what's the topic about? So is about if gravity exists or if uh, the moon has something to do with Earth's gravity. I mean, gravity. I'm asking. You know, why? Why is the moon resting? Based, you know, if it's in space, like your scientists claim and they say. How can it be rusting in space? Isn't isn't it supposed to be inside of a vacuum? Okay, first of all, the, the thing you know, right? You say that the due to the science of saying that the moon's in space, why is it rusting? Then how come you know if the information there is true? Sir, did like you hear what I said? That it's actually rusting. Sir, did you hear what I yeah. said? Yeah. Yeah. So how Where is it rusting? That. Sir. Why do y'all come on my live, bro? If y'all just trying to be argumentative, don't come on my live if you don't want to listen. Oh, oh, well, Max, you know, any words to prove? Block you from ever coming back to my account. Listen or get down. Once again, sir, isn't space supposed to be a vacuum? Space is a vacuum and the moon isn't rusting. This is from NASA.gov. So how can you say that? Now you're just a liar. What do you mean? How can I? The moon is. If the moon is rusting, then the Earth should also be rusting too. You should understand that. Also, now nah, you you. Tr Boy, like, do you have brain? Good lord, this is. I don't even understand. Like, you don't comprehend. You. Yo, yeah, man. Hey, look, you know what? I think you might be onto something with the 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 magnetism and everything. I know. Yeah. No, I no, am, sir. Gravity, gravity has to be the same, is it? Like, it's just a different frequency of mag mag magnetism, and like, 
yeah, you could be right with that one. I'm not gonna not gonna delude myself in that. And with this moon stuff, you know, like the sun, whether it's a flat Earth or globe or anything, yeah, the sun gives off waves. So you get solar waves, yeah. So that's how they 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 can put up like water. Hey, brother, do you can you prove gravity exists though? Um, no, but I can answer the moon thing. This is what I'll come on to answer the first time. Is basically the the solar winds, yeah, that hit the Earth, blow off like they there's apparently we've got magnetic bubbles, yeah. So we've got like the heliosphere, um, and some other I, I can't remember on my hand, yeah. But the wind, the solar winds, bend them back and take oxygen from our planet to the top of the moon, which rushes the metal that's on the moon. Like, that's the only thing that I know. Like, even even that could be fake. Like, I don't know, bro. I'm, I'm just one of them. But that's the that's the stuff that I've seen and I've researched. But do you know what I mean? It's, it's one of them. No, but look, there's no right. question for that. You're right. There's I've no watched it anyway. But look, look. Hey, how is that possible when space is supposed to be a vacuum? No, because the, how does a solar wind then travel from the sun to us? If there ha there has to be some kind of movement, G. Like you're right. Because you're right. The sun some... is in our local atmospheres right here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But still, so like the effects of that would still go back, like if that makes sense. Like it would still go back. <laughs> no. no, it's funny. Wait, but you think you can uh, present any evidence behind gravity? Behind gravity, the only thing I'd suggest is to be like you'd have to try different frequencies through electromagnetism. So then to see if it attracts, like, so once you amp the frequency to a certain level, it might attract inanimate objects that don't hold that much magnetism. Like, if that well, makes sense. Sir, anything I do behind electromagnetism, it will be through electromagnetism, not gravity. Exactly, That's exactly. Kind of gravity is only a word. It's just the name for something. You switch the frequency. None of that matters. No, you're right. You're right. But if they called it shoelace, then it'd be we'd be proving what shoelace is right now. <laughs> Do you know what I'm saying? It's just the name they gave it. That like gravity is a name. This. No one here can prove you, I'm, I'm this. Watching, No one. I'm, I'm gonna, gonna watch. Down. Go let the yeah, please, 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 please. Nobody can prove gravity exists. No one. Hey, how's it going? How you doing, man? How you doing? Pretty good. Um, the moon is rusting. Can we touch base on that real fast? Yeah, this is what NASA is saying. Right. Um, so there's a few things about that. One, your your vacuum comment isn't necessarily proven. With, I mean, I guess how do I? The world, the word vacuum isn't by. I don't think you're using it with the right definition, right? I think I'm assuming that when you say vacuum, you mean like it's so just is space, a, not a vacuum that they proclaim. Uh. It's, it's a near vacuum, right? Because by vacuum, what we use by definition means that there's not like anything pertaining matter. However, space in its entirety or contains. When you watch a movie and a hole punctures the ship in that movie when they're on in space, what happens? Are 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 we? That's science fiction, my guy. Are we really gonna? Yeah, they're, 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 we're going off of movies. Nothing, sir. Are we going what off happened? of movies? <laughs> okay, in the movie, it's a movie. What movie. happens, sir? What right. happens? What happens? What happens? I don't know. They bust out of the hole, I guess. Exactly. So, is the space a vacuum or not? It's a move. Okay, it's so like Did I just they said. Say it's, space it's... is a vacuum or not? Okay, so it's... what does NASA say about space? Right. So, if you read this, if you read the article about this, actually, hey, sir, we don't of... want your answer, sir. We want what NASA say about space. What do they say? Right, even NASA says about this space. I said it's not in vacuum, right? Like if you read the article it's, that you just posted vacuum, behind you, sir. okay. So if you vacuum, right? But if you read the article that you said behind you, that you, you literally right. have behind you, but you was just lying earlier. But you said right, but you was lying earlier. Just want to clarify that up. Go ahead. Okay, so by definition, vacuum that you were thinking of isn't necessarily true, right? Because Once the vacuum again, NASA says vacuum. Go ahead. Oh, okay. Right, so it's a vacuum, but it's not let the vacuum say. But anyway, the moon That's rusting is a vacuum. Go ahead. <laughs> so the moon rusting in the said vacuum is actually not the, the stereotypical it's rust, right? Like the actual like NASA says it is. Uh, okay, I, I just uh, we're we're over it. We're on the next thing, my guy. Right, making sure you know though, my guy. Come on, Jack. What you got, Jack? 
So the rust that's actually been discovered on the moon is actually more commonized by using it's called it's a um, what's it Fe two O, which is a uh-huh. uh, formidium oxide or whatnot, fer- ferric uh-huh. oxide, right? But right. the moon has a containing of surface that's made of ferricic oxide, right? So then when you have any type of material inside that vacuum. And that doesn't is, it take a little bit of water for that, sir? It takes water for that, right? Yeah, we discovered water on Earth. Right. Right? Okay. So how does water survive in space, sir? Explain we that. Found, what? It's on the moon. Not, it's on the moon. We discovered how water. How does it survive, on... sir? On the moon in space. Explain. Explain. We discover water. We discover water on the moon in like 2008. Like that's not like it's not in a large. How place. is it surviving, my guy? Explain that part. What do you mean by surviving? We didn't ask when they found it. We asked how is that water still there? And not evaporating. That's what I want to know how. The surface temperature of the moon is not copacetic of being eva- to evaporate water. Like that. Why didn't the vacuum? Why didn't the vacuum? You know, make it start boiling and evaporating. That's what happens when you put water in a vacuum. <laughs> um. So in a wait, wait, wait. Okay. Um, if you were to put water in a vacuum, it starts to boil. Sir, what happens if you have a tank and you put it in a very strong vacuum chamber? What happens? You have a tank of water and you put it inside of a very strong vacuum chamber. What happens? <laughs> I just wait. I want to just. I want to understand something. So, sir, what <laughs> happens? Answer the question. It, it 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 boils. I guess I don't know what happens. To, I actually don't know. Okay, is that what I just said? And so it boils. So then the surface temperature of the moon isn't necessarily... So why is there still water on the moon, sir? Because it's not... There's When you get... There's, I'm sorry, the moon has an atmosphere, because right? it's not in space. It's right in mo- our local atmosphere. Built but the space, moon has an atmosphere. The moon moon has an atmosphere, right? I don't. It, it does, though. No, it don't. So it doesn't have an atmosphere? Right here in our local atmosphere. How can it? I'm sorry, can you repeat that? I don't get that. The moon is in our atmosphere. The moon is in our local atmosphere. Yes, sir. The moon is in our atmosphere. It's in our atmosphere beneath the firmament. Can you give me the man name, sir, that flew out to Mars to prove your scientific claims behind a Mars being a globe? I mean, a sphere. Can y'all, can you give me that? Mars? Yeah, can you give me the man name that flew out to Mars to prove science claim for Mars being a sphere? Uh, no person. Can you give me the man name? I, I don't think. Yeah, space How do we specific. go from the moon to Mars? What does Mars have to do with any of this? I go from where I want because I'm walking the globe. Wait, so we went from. <laughs> hey, you know that blanket test they claimed that proved gravity? You know it was debunked due to the Earth's electromagnetic waves that emits from the Earth. Every test was debunked due to these waves. But anyway, that's, go ahead. That's not. That's not. Wait. The blanket test. Oh, are you talking about like the fabric of like space time? Yeah, you know them, that fabric. No, not the fabric of space time. Do you know about the test they proclaimed with the blanket? You know, you can use a. Blanket. It's not really a. It's not really I'll a test. More of a. to the center. That's common sense. That don't even make no sense. Everybody know that it's a blanket. But anyway, though, um, right? But you know it's not really an experiment. Yeah, yeah, I know. It's, I know what you're you talking know the about. Blanket they use and the uh, and the objects they use was actually literally from the Earth. So that means it was all magnetic to a certain extent. Keep it on it. But go on, man. Right, but that's not entirely true. There are several objects inside of the Earth that we currently proclaim that doesn't have ele- any type of electromagnetic properties. For instance, Everything glass would be Earth one of them. Plastic would be magnetic to a certain extent. Glass is magnetic. What are you talking about? How, gla- how could the electronic structure and mechanic structure of glass would not proclaim to have electric? No, what? <laughs> Sounds good. Wait a minute. Yes, slow. wait a minute. Glass is magnetic because it is created through a bypass of cement dust. What you saying now, Jack? Oh, wait, 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 wait. What? Yeah, Jack. Hey, Jack, say Jack. Hey, say Jack. Wood is magnetic, Jack, through heat injection, Jack, from the earth, Jack, or the sun, Jack. I, okay, okay. Um, yeah, I'm Jack, sorry. yeah, Jack. Hey, Jack, did you know uh, uh, plastic was magnetic too, Jack? Did you know that there, Jack? Because you know you can actually make plastic, Jack, from clay, Jack. You know, I'm talking about an earthy material, Jack, com- you know, composed mainly of hydrous aluminum, silicates, Jack, and other minerals, Jack, which is plastic when moist, Jack, but hard when wet f- and when fire, Jack. You know what I'm talking about, Jack? 
No, because the principle. You know what? You got some points. You got some points there. I oh, mean, I plastic. Know Jack. It's all Trotsky. You know what I'm talking about, Jack. Hey, Jack. Say, Jack. Do your gravity have a body plan, Jack? What do you mean by body plan? Like a free body oh, plan? Oh, man, what I mean by that, man, is, man, hey, man, say, man, does your gravity, man, have architectural arrangement, man, of a biological structure, man, which can't be gas, Jack, you know what I'm talking about, man? Uh. But, God. <laughs> yeah, man, biological you know, kind of. You know what I'm talking about, though? I, yeah, I'm with Jack, it. I'm what with you got it. for I'm that? So let me let me let me break it down for you, facts, real quick, right? Hey, Jack, so you got these things real quick. No, though, no, Jack, no, 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 no. Let me, I'm about. just spit some truth. I'm about to spit some truth. You know, let me let me spit my truth. Let me spit my truth. You right. So you got these particle things right, that are messed up with these magical things called electrons, right? These electrons have these free bodies. Hey, on top Max, another electrons and neutrons and neutron jacks. So on top of our jacks, they have those types of things. Jack, you about to get the You understand, though, man? Damn, we don't even want to hear the truth, Master P. That's real. That's crazy. They don't even want to hear the truth. Jack, tell me, Jack. They don't even want to hear the truth. They don't even want to. Dang, they don't even want to hear the truth. They just want to hear hey, Jack, cat. That's man, crazy. Exactly, man. Did your gravity have a body plan or not, man? What's yeah, I'm trying to explain you the body plan, bro, but you're not trying to hear me out. I'm trying to hear the truth. Like a... Jack, let me explain you what a body plan is so you can know what it is. You're the All right, speak your truth. Speak your truth. You're far left with this here, man. Yeah, man. Hey, man, say, man, a body plan is basic architectural arrangement of a biological structure which can be gas. You dig? So, hey, Jack, say, Jack. Did your right, gravity so when you have, have another a body plan, ski? Yeah, so when you have another force or that's large enough that overturns the principles of gas, you can get solids, right, or the forms of liquids and change the property of said properties when you get those in a larger quantity and enough energy to go and force those electrons and particles that make up said gas to go into a solid object or into another state of matter. All you need to do would to have that said energy would be to excite said electrons to their, uh, what is it, their electric core past what their current outer shell would be. Then you would get any type of change of matter that would have formed into another body plan. Does that make sense? No, it don't, Jack, because you didn't miss some Gravitrons. You know what I'm talking about? And without your Gravitrons, Jack, hey, Jack, say, Jack, you know your gravity never and didn't exist, man. That mean it wasn't in a part of the gas or the, it wasn't a part of the gas during the Big Bang. So that mean your gravity was never brought into existence, man. You missed the but first you part. You weren't down, listening. Down. You weren't listening, Frank. You were not listening, Frank. Oh, shit, you missed Jack, the first part. Everything you were saying was just a theory anyway, yo. Um, not even a theory. It's been, it's been, you can do this. Hey, it's Jack, say, Jack. Hey, 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 Jack. What's up? Yeah. Yeah. Yo, yo, gravity was not a part of the gas that was in the Big Bang, so it was never brought into existence, man. Yeah, man. Because your gravitrons don't exist. And without them there, Jack, yeah, man. Hey, you may say, man. Gravity don't exist, man. But magnetism yeah. was? I don't, like, don't even make no sense. Now you just spit. Now you just spit nothing. Just be spitting. But Jack, though, I'm going to let you down and move on to the next. I got you. I got you. Good talk. Good talk. Up here to really kick for the people that they can really stand on behind that their gravity. You dig? So we're going to carry on with this here. All right. I got you. I got you. I'm going to listen in. So, Jack, you have a smooth ski. You hear me? Yeah, yeah, man. We ain't playing no more of these little uh, games. With none of these people. Period. We gonna have fun with this here. I'm doing it my way. Yeah. Hello. Uh, can you? What's up, Jack? Hear me properly? Yeah, I hear you, Jack. Can you hear me? Yeah, Jack. What's happening? Okay, great. Shalski. What's up? Everything good. What's happening? So, uh, you wanted you wanted a proof of a physical form for gravity, right? Yeah, yeah Jack. You got that. Okay, well, uh, okay. gravity comes from, you know, mag magnetism comes from electrons and protons. I want gravity, protons. Jack. Get back to gravity, Gra Jack. Get back to gravity, Jack. Yep. And yeah. gravity comes from mass itself. Oh, that's cool, Jack. Let me know the it's element that's inside your mass, Jack. So, that's emitting your gravity, Jack. What's the element inside that mass, Jack? You're in the dig and stands so we can know all the way, though, man. It's have a real any element standing behind your gravity. You feel me, Bo -bo -do -do? Yeah. Every atom, every thing in the universe has gravity just because of having mass. Prove that, just Jack. As every, just as every atom... Uh, has electrons and protons and has Jack, you gotta electromagnetic your brain, Jack, by force into that element inside that mass that's emitting your gravity, Jack. You gotta dig and stand that. If you don't, Jack, I don't even know what to tell you no more. You feel me though? Yeah, for example, uh, 
you know, every everything has a certain now, level of, uh, example, Jackie, of the electromagnetic. I'm going to have to kick you all the way back. You know what I'm talking about, man? Because you didn't even do what you're supposed to when you came up here anyway. So, Jack, this is your last chance. Can you pres- Oh, look at him. He caught his own cut. I can dig it, bro, because you knew you didn't and couldn't come up here and present nothing. Yeah. No more plan of getting this here. We're giving it to him the real way. Uh, hello? What's up? Where did I see you back, man? Did you go back and do some homework and did you find a little something, something behind your gravity, son? <laughs> well, I didn't actually want to talk about the gravity anymore. Cause, um, oh, that's what we're talking about. Oh, I don't know what you hollering. You ain't coming up here telling me what to talk I was, about. I was talking about the He's moon. He's on my live. You hear me, man? Hey, man, say, man. I advise you jump back on the gravity before you catch a big boot ski. So you don't want to talk about the moon resting that night? Go ahead. What you got for it? Okay, so uh, you said that um, that the moon must be resting because it's in our uh, it's in our atmosphere. The moon is resting, sir, due to oxygen and water. Yeah, did. I know, but I was asking if you said that uh, that's because it was oh, yeah, in, in our atmosphere. Earth's atmosphere. Yeah. So in our how atmosphere. would you explain like eclipses and stuff? What would be like obscuring our the view? The ones you've seen that they told you be happening. Like the put it, what the bro? What happened to my? What is going on? Okay. Uh, no, I'm saying well, like, what life. they're saying about. Nah, I'm about to end my live. Watch out, bro. Y'all trying to tell on me and stuff. My life, bro. 